And finally this evening, a unique bond between a young man with special needs and his life-size stuffed dog is coming to life on the pages of a children's book. A Dog and His Boy, The Adventures of Spillway and Scotty was published last month, and since then, Scotty Winsel's family has been on a mission to get that book and its message of acceptance of all people of all abilities into elementary schools and libraries not only in Maine, but worldwide. New Center Maine's Vivian Lee has more from Scarborough. It's a story about a unique friendship, one that has no limits. When we go riding horses, he brings me right along. A Dog and His Boy, The Adventures of Spillway and Scotty is a rhyming book featuring colorful pictures by Maine illustrator Claudia Diller. Today, 300 students at Pleasant Hill Elementary School, along with members of Scarborough High School's Buddy System program, went along for the ride of Spillway's life with Scotty Wenzel by his side. But right before we go to sleep, we party and we play. Scotty, who's already had a lifetime of heart surgeries, has Dubowitz syndrome. The extremely rare chromosomal disorder causes physical and developmental delays. Scotty started therapy at a very young age. His parents also immersed him in activities from skiing and riding horses to surfing. And ever since his mother Lisa brought home this life-size stuffed dog, the two have never been apart. Lisa wrote the book with Heidi Bullen, a longtime friend, a third grade teacher, and a children's book author. Their goal, teaching kids at an early age that they have the same dreams and aspirations as people of all abilities. And they want the same things as they do. They want friends. They want to be included in, their, in work and play and in the community. Ski, Scotty can ski. They water ski, Scotty can water ski. They ride horses, Scotty can ride horses, you know, and to make that connection. Scotty and Spillway also made an appearance. Scotty, who is nonverbal, showed how he communicates using this special device. Hi, Heidi. I love you. <laughs> A message of empathy and inclusivity that's heading home for these youngsters. It doesn't matter if you have a disability. It just matters if you have friends. They're not the same as you. They're still... They still are a part of this world. Scotty's family is going on the road taking the book to kids across Maine. Crescent Park Elementary School, where Bullen teaches, bought 300 of them. 700 more will be given to elementary school children in Scarborough. Now, Maine businesses are stepping up in a big way to share Spillway and Scotty's message of acceptance. CMP plans to distribute 600 copies of the book in libraries and schools in its service area. And you can find a dog and his boy on the shelves at L.L. Bean. But Lisa isn't stopping till the book goes across the globe. We're hoping to get on the Today Show or and any any news, big news affiliates and just get the word out there. Inspiring the next generation that welcomes everyone, no matter their differences. In Scarborough, Vivian Lee, New Center, Maine. By the way, a, pro, a percentage of the proceeds from the sale of that book will be donated to the nonprofit Scotty is involved with. If you'd like more information on how to get a copy, you can head to our website or our new Center Main app.